Every brother Let's call it in the crossfire Let's call it in the crossfire Hey guys, what is up? Um, so a friend wanted me to do like a little tutorial on how to use Pixel Lab or like where everything is and all that. Anyways, um, you know, here it is. Here's the app right here. And then here's the gallery. It's just gallery, you know. Pixel Lab, we're gonna go into it. And you know, okay, we're gonna start over here. These are basically like a setup type of thing, like a default do that um, you know you can make a meme it's it's kind of like uh, what is it you pretty much uh, like it gets everything set up for you these are basically like default you know we got default thin it's like a setup for you so all you gotta do is edit the text and edit whatever you want change the background and all that and it's good to go if you go over here, you can like, see how I selected the top text. If you go to edit. It says YouTube, it's in that meme type of font, you know. So let's go ahead and start up a whole new thing here. Bam, it's all blank. Change the image size. Just you a YouTube thumbnail. Now if we go to the fourth button over here. Go to from gallery. And we'll just use this. Select all. And you're gonna go to the third button now. You could draw, use shapes, import, or use stickers. Uh, my friend wanted me to show him how to get strokes on a gun from Call of Duty for thumbnails. So we're going to go to import. Uh, we'll just use... Let's see. We'll just go ahead and get a bunch of these. I'll just use this again for an example here. Resize it. Here it is. Relative position. All the way at the very bottom. And we can go to the position here and just move it over. Now we still have it selected, so we can go and stroke. Enable, and as you can see, it outlines it. You can mess with this, make it bigger, whatever. I normally put mine at two or three. Put this one at three. And bam. Now you can go ahead and add a shadow. Just makes it look a lot better. And then if you go to the second button here, which is text or quotes or whatever, go to text, go to edit. <coughs> and we'll just put in like a <coughs> black, my bad. Black Ops 3. Solo pile up. And we'll just put like giant for an example a line middle that's what this is what I like to do you can go to the font I normally use chunk 5 and go to color solo pile up I like to highlight that in green and then I go to the stroke turn it on it highlights it black and I put it at 6 uh, shadow turn on the shadow Then we just go to the text size Put that wherever we want and there you go um, Let's see here You know that's pretty much it I mean You got your default set up in here you got your text and quotes Importing like your images your stickers you can draw shapes and all that This right here is changing the picture like the color the transparency, you know Image size image from gallery and all this stuff from camera you take a picture 
aspect ratio, and then this right here is just effects. Like this. Enable that, you know, you can do stripes. Um, brightness, you just got all that. This here, um, contrast, saturation, it's just pretty much all that. When you want to save it, you just go up here to the three dots up here at the top right corner. Go to export image and hit save to gallery. And that's pretty much it. If you guys enjoyed this tutorial, please comment, rate, subscribe for more. And I'm going to get off.